hello what's up guys in this video i am going to show you how you can install wordpress in your namecheap hosting so first thing that you will need to do is to search for namecheap.com on google once you search for it click on the first website that appear and right here it will say login and then you can click on login enter your login details and you can log into your account once you will click on login a similar interface will appear on your browser from here you will see the domain name that is register then here you will see the products that you currently have then there will be some expirations and there will be an option for manage in order to install the wordpress you will, what you will have to do is to hover your mouse over this icon and then you click on go to the c panel once you click on go to cpanel, it will start redirecting to cpanel and cpanel will appear like this. From here, you will choose Softaculous App Installer and then from here, you can choose WordPress. And this WordPress, you will have to click on install now and from here, you can write the uh, site name site description and you can choose if it is a multi-site or if you want to disable wordpress code then here you can type your uh, admin details for wordpress and here you will write the admin email and right here you can choose the language and these are some of the plugins that you can choose if you want and there are some options for the theme so for me i just want it to be for now i want it to say my blog and my wordpress blog and for for here uh, i want the admin username to be admin and for the admin password i will change this to whatever i want and the admin email is all fine i do not want this plugin i only want this wp total cache and that's it once that is done uh, make sure to choose your domain i have https protocol already which means i have already installed the ssl certificate on my domain and here is my domain name which is the weberpro.com and here you can choose the wordpress version i want these details to be sent to my email address and then i will click on install once you will click on install this will just take a couple of minutes and the wordpress will get installed on your domain on cpanel of your namecheap account once that is done you can check your domain and you can see that wordpress is installed in order to log into your wordpress dashboard you can use this administrative url which is your domain name slash wp dash admin and this will redirect me to the login page it didn't redirect me to the login page because i have uh, directly opened this but when the next time i will try to log in it will ask me for my login username and password so that's it for this video if you like this video please hit the subscribe button and click on like icon and share this video with your friends thank you very much have a good day